know. We have to know. We need answers about bath toys right now, more than anything. Hi, everybody. Hello. Okay, I am Brielle. Um, I am a mom of two girls, and they're absolutely fantastic, and you'll end up seeing them if you don't already know them. Um, Serenity will be turning 10 in December, and Harmony is 7 and will be 8 in April, and they're hilarious and super funny. Um, so, why we are here today for my very first YouTube video is bath toys. Okay, so I've seen this lots throughout my um, almost 10 years of um, mothering, parenting, and uh, it, about the bath toys. You guys know about this, about the bath toys and, and squeezing them out. You got to squeeze them out super good after bath time because then there's all this stuff that's inside of them. And I've heard about this for years. And so I became like a crazy squeezer outer. Like I, like that's, that was like my Saturday night squeezing out bath toys. I mean, I squeezed them out every bath time, but I like, that was like a thing I did for quite some time when the girls were super little was like squeeze them until there was nothing left in them. Um, one, I don't like buying stuff. I just don't, I'm super cheap. So, um, here's a confession. Oh, I'm super gross, but I'm a mom and most moms are. So just so you know, I actually have <clears throat> a bucket of bath toys beside me over here. And, uh, my, my kids still play with them. So we just, I've just kept them. And I've had some of these bath toys for 10 years. So this is uh, like a, a like a dual triple video. One, it's my first video. So that's cool. Two, um, confessions of a mom. Gross. And three, is it true? Is it true? Is the buildup inside of the toys? I've done nothing special to these. I got enough stuff to do. I don't have time to do special things to tub toys. Okay. I just squeeze the bejeezers out of them. And as I was cleaning up the bathroom this morning, I started looking at those and that thing I saw on the Facebook where she cut open the ducky and the ducky was black inside. And I was like, Ooh. that popped into my head. And I thought, hmm, that's going to be my first video is... Is there really gross stuff inside of 10 year old bathtub toys? So judge me, please. I love it. Do it. Judge away. Um, but like I said, I'm not perfect and I do my due diligence where I can. Squeezing like crazy. Uh, I haven't replaced them. Nope. I will have to after this though. So I have, uh, have a little piece of paper towel here because it might be gross. I got a cutting board so things are less slippery. I don't know. I tend to not be the most graceful character in the world, um, especially with the sharp objects. Yeah. So have fun. We may end up in a merge later on. So here's my bath toys. And literally, that's 10 years old. Guaranteed. That that's definitely 10 years old. These ones are really hard to squeeze because they're not quite as soft as these little guys. Got a gator. None of these are new. Like, if you guys know me, which you are getting to, I am so very cheap, but I also care about my family's health a lot. My sister-in-law said that she replaces hers every so often. I thought, man, that's really, like, you're really on the ball. Mine takes 10 years. <laughs> okay, so here's Sharky. Mm, I don't want to do it. Let's do it. Okay, friends. Oh my God, I'm so scared. Hey, man. There's nothing. 
one, not even in the little crooks or nothing. Okay, Ducky. Ducky has been kicking around forever. I'm taking a look. Do y'all see any yuckies? No yuckies. Oh, well, that's a relief. Oh, guys, I think this might be the one. Ew. Well, I'm proud to say that though my squeezing definitely worked. Oh dear, can you see? You see the little flex? I can only imagine what's, oh, it's bad. It's really bad. Like, no, well, not really. Cause like in the thing on Facebook, it was like completely black and I don't have like the greatest lighting but there's flecks of nasty. Mind blown. Okay, we've learned a lesson. I am going to get rid of all of these super, super hard ones. They gotta go, bye guys. But as far as my really soft little guys go, and I can see inside of there too, they look pretty clean. So super hard bath toys that are hard to squeeze, no good. Really super squishy ones, and you squish all those drops of water out, can go for 10 years. Now we know, you're welcome. That's what I'm here for. All right, team. We are opening these, and my mom owes me a new one of these. Okay, so I just broke the, no the news to the girls that I cut some of their bath toys. And as I was telling them of this experience, thinking I was awesome. Remember when I cut the duck? I have really bad lighting in this area. Oh I have really God. pretty That's uh, that. light that comes through here. That's but a cat the, right there. That is cat. Uh, but I have bad lighting. Anyway, uh, so I was sitting in, the, in my living room, which is like yeah. all of five feet away, which has great lighting. Why don't I go there? I don't know. I'm not sure yet. I looked inside duck, like right up in in there. That's great. Um, sorry. In his head, where it's not, it's not okay. Nice. It's not okay. So I have confessions. Confessions. She's buying us of bath a mom. Toys after. See, I'm buying new bath toys, girls. Oh, I'm scared. Okay, mm ladies. Look. <gasps> mom, go sew them. Oh, for sure. I have to show them, honey. You gotta like know what you're working <gasps> Cut with. Cut the mouth. Yeah, what's inside the mouth? Well, it's just. Cut it. Mm. Can I get some cutting? Can I get some cutting in there? Yeah. Let me use the scissors, Mama. Can I cut this one? Um, hold no, tight, my friends. Me. I'm gonna get this one. I, yeah, subscribe. Yeah. But really, the ultimate goal is to show people, like, when you YouTube a family, they usually have, like, a swimming pool or... No, don't do that, Yucky, okay? Uh -huh. um, and, like, all like all these different awesome things. And I just want to show the hilarity that is, like, this life. And it's none of those things. So... And ring the bell. And ring. Stop. <laughs> what are you 